Hello everyone, Future Joaquin here. Uh, I just wanted to make a little disclaimer for this video because I've been hearing all the anti-Semitic messed up crap Kanye has been spewing out lately, and I just wanted to make it clear I don't support that. This video was recorded before the before those events, and um, I just wanted to make it clear that I'm I'm not cool with that at all. But thanks to you guys, I made the decision to still make still make this video because I still think it's. I still think the video has a lot of potential to be really good, and the the documentary is still good, and the uh, I, I still will always like his music. So, but to separate the art from the artist, I do not support what Kanye has been saying, and I wanted to make that clear. So, thank you guys, and I hope you enjoy the video. Love you. For those who don't know, Genius is a docu series on Netflix about famous rapper and producer Ye, formerly known as Kanye Breast West. It explores how he started his career and the obstacles that were in his way through the perspective of old footage shot by Cody Simmons. There are a total of three episodes, and each episode is about an hour and a half long. And honestly, the whole thing is definitely worth a watch. It's well shot, well edited, well directed, and just a well written piece of art. And probably one of the best documentaries you can watch on Netflix. So you know what? I'm going to talk about it. So get cozy, get a snack or something like popcorn, and enjoy. One thing most people notice about this show is how it's shot, and let me tell you, it's shot pretty well. Like I mentioned earlier, Cody Simmons shot the entire thing from the beginning of Kanye's career to the most recent point, and it's very visually appealing. The whole series is also edited very well considering what they had to work with. The fact that the editor had to go through all of this old scrap footage and compile it together in a way that made sense and was easy to understand must have been a very daunting task. But he pulled it off, and it came out great in the end. The writing and directing is incredible too. The first two episodes mostly take place before the release of Kanye's debut album, The College Dropout, while the third episode covers everything after that album's release. The docuseries does a good job of showcasing how Kanye essentially started from nothing and how much he struggled to get his work out there. He wanted to prove that he was more than a producer and how he could rap too, but it took a while for his label to properly realize that. Even if you're not fond of Kanye, watching this really makes you respect him more considering how much he worked to get to his spot. The show also makes you feel bad for him too, because it brings into light how much the death of his mother and how his bipolar disorder negatively affected him, which can be seen mainly in the final episode. The fact that this documentary makes you see one of the most controversial music artists in a new light is quite frankly impressive as hell. So yeah, those are my thoughts. I guess my only critique would be that maybe Cody's narration at points is a bit un unnecessary. Blech. But other than that, it's great. Some might think I'm biased due to the fact that I'm quite a fan of Mr. Breast West's music, and some people might quickly bat their eyes from this because they just see his name in the title. But trust me, give this a shot. Even people who aren't fans of his music will find themselves engaged in learning a lot. And if you are a fan, what the hell are you doing?